Crushers use compression, shearing, or attrition to break coal, rock, or ore into progressively smaller pieces. Mining companies select crushers based upon the type of material mined, the size of material to be fed to the crusher, and product size and gradation requirements. The most common types of crushers are jaw, gyratory, cone, roll, hammer, and impactor. Miners need protection when working near an operating crusher cavity to prevent reaching or falling into the equipment during operation. Primary crushers, such as gyratory and jaw types, are often lower than dump points surrounding work areas and walkways. Crusher approaches should be guarded on all sides to keep miners from entering these hazardous areas, except where an area is clearly designated for feeding or truck dumping. In closed control rooms, sturdy, well-maintained handrails or walls around the crusher inlet all provide good protection to miners who might otherwise be subject to falling into crushers. During dumping activities, it's possible for rocks to roll out of or away from crushers or feeders, possibly injuring the feet or legs of miners nearby. Safe operators control dumping to prevent hopper overfilling, and some construct retaining walls around crusher inlets to ensure all dumped material stays inside. Dumping or feeding rock into a crusher, clearing crusher chokes or bridges, and the breaking action of the crusher itself cause rock, chips, or pieces of tramp metal to be ejected from the machine. The likelihood of this happening is affected by the type of crusher, the shape of its feed chute and crushing cavity, and the type and hardness of the material being crushed. Some crushers, like secondary cone crushers, are often elevated above surrounding walking and working surfaces, effectively guarding persons from the fall-in hazard. Best practice is to guard or cover the feed opening to prevent reach-in and ejected material injuries. Flying rock and material, regardless of size, can cause eye injuries, bone fractures, and lacerations. Here are some ways to protect crusher operators and nearby miners from this hazard. A sturdy control room with its door on a side away from the crusher will usually provide safe access. Plexiglass windows offer good protection to those inside and allow the operator to monitor operations safely. Metal mesh screens across windows also offer protection but may reduce visibility. Walls extending above head level can be built around crushers for additional flying object protection. If walls made of non-transparent materials are used, they may be equipped with unbreakable viewing windows. Walkways may be blocked with chains or other barriers during crusher operation to prevent close approach to crushers. Warning signs can remind miners about ejected material hazards, but no one should rely on them as primary safeguards.